Yo, what's going on with y'all boys and girls today? How y'all doing today? Um, this video will be showing how to set up everything on Kick. As you can see right here, it's taking me a couple, took me about an hour to do, but I finally managed to set up everything. As you can see on the right, I have my chat up there. Um, I have a follow alert. Um, show y'all that. Boom. Follow alert right here. Got a sub alert. Boom. And we got a gift alert. And we're gonna be showing all you guys how to set that up today. We also got commands to show, so you can insert any command you have from any other streaming platform onto Kick. We're gonna show how to look at stats. We're gonna show how to do polls, and we're gonna show how to do text to speech. And lastly, we're gonna be showing how to do emotes, which is one of the easiest things to do. I'm not gonna lie. As you can see, I have animated emotes and regular emotes here. So without further ado, let's get into it. All right, to start this off, we're gonna show you guys how to get your emotes in here and what the size in is. You get 24 emotes for subs. All right, so now let's get to the emotes. So on kick, you get a total of 54 regular channel emotes and 24 sub emotes. And with channel emotes, they can only be used in your chat. None of these other channel emotes can be used in nobody else's chat. But sub emotes, once you unlock the sub button, you'll be able to use in any chat you choose to be. So as you can see right now, I have all these animated emotes and I got some more emotes up here. And to get this set up, it's pretty easy. So the emote sizing on kit is 500 by 500 and it cannot go over one megabyte. Okay, now say you have a gift that you want to do. So for me, I'm gonna wanna put this little sad bear as an email, right? So I'm gonna save it, right? I'm gonna name it sad, whatever it is, right? So we're gonna take this right here. All the links will be put in the description below. We're gonna put sad eye bear there, right? And then we're gonna upload it. And once again, it can be a total of 500 but by 500 and it can't go over one megabyte. So if we go here, right, and we resize it, it's gonna be at 1.38 megabytes. You can't do that, you can't do that. So we're gonna make it a little bit smaller. We're gonna make it a little bit smaller until we can get to that one megabyte threshold. Boom, put it at 400 by 400, what does it bring us to? Boom, perfect, right? So now we're gonna convert it, or now we're gonna save it, boom. And then just like that, we're gonna go right back to kick. We're gonna put this emote right here into into right here. I can name it Sad Bear. Now, no, 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 there's another thing. Before I put this in, you can. There's a website to easily remove every background, and like I said, everything will be listed below. So I'm gonna import this file, right? The one that we just resized. I'm gonna save this. So now that it's done, right? Like I was saying, we're gonna go here, and we're gonna go here, and now look at that. Just like that, the background is removed. So we're gonna name this Sad Bear. Boom, right? And just like that, you got you an animated emote. Boom, it's pretty that simple. And the same thing goes with channel emotes, right? So there's a whole, everything, like I said, everything will be listed in the description below for all of it. So boom, all you're gonna have to do is add your picture or whatever you want into this website called Twitch Resizer, and you're just gonna download it. So on kick, it's 500 by 500, I already told you that. Boom, download it. Go to channel emotes, just upload it, name it, and just like that, you got your regular emotes. All right, and so next, on to chat. Now chat, there's two different ways that you can have your chat. If you see right here, through Livebot, this is how this is how chat looks, right? And it doesn't fade at all. That's the only thing I don't like. It doesn't fade at all, but it's easy to set up. You know what I'm saying? This is how I have my setup. These are the settings I have. And I also have it so it shows my profile picture, which I thought was an amazing idea. I thought that was pretty cool. I've never seen that before. And then I also made it so that everything is transparent, kind of like other chats, right? Right? I like this one as well, but at the same time, I don't. This is how you set up this kick chat via kickchat.corar.tv, right? And it's pretty easy, you know what I'm saying? This one, it fades, and to test it out, so we're gonna go to, we're gonna go to my chat, I'm just gonna spam something. And that's how it looks, that's how it looks. Personally, I prefer the one that doesn't fade. I don't see myself using this one at all, just because I don't like, I don't, I don't know, it's easy, but you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? If you want to use this one, by all means. But I will link both of these down. It's pretty easy to set it up. You just put in your channel name, put on the size you want. You put animate badges, high commands, all that, whatever you want. You can hide bot, you can have the messages fade, and you just generate it, and boom, it's simple as that. This one is easily simple. It's easy. It's easily more simple. This one, this one is kind of difficult to, to figure out, but you could also look at it, you know what I'm saying? You see how we got Sarah Smith and all these people typing? This is what it would look like. You know what I'm saying? 
you know what I'm saying? You can put more work and effort into it. All right, and now on to the follow alerts. Follow alerts are pretty cool. It's pretty simple how it works as well. Let me show y'all mine. So boom, it's only gonna play once. It played twice because of how it is in preview, but plays right here on the left and it's pretty simple to set up so what you're gonna do right you can use anything you want you can go to Giphy right here and you can select a GIF if you like anything here or you can get your own from media library and how you're gonna do that is you're gonna go to media library you're gonna choose from your files these are the ones I currently have uploaded you're gonna upload it to whatever you want it can be an image it can be a video it can be whatever you want boom and then you're gonna click it right and then it's gonna be there right so then you can have the animations how you want this is how i have mine you know what i'm saying i didn't really touch it and then the sound sound is also the same thing you're gonna uh upload it from whatever sound you want and me how i did this so how i did this is i already had all of this uploaded via streamlab so all i had to do was copy url put in here and download it and i had every sound that i wanted to put in here and that's what i did with these three sounds and it works the same with the uh, the gifts or how you want your uh, animation to be when you get a sub or follow all that uh let me show you that real quick like i said all that is the same so it's pretty easy you just copy you're gonna go copy url put it right here boom copy and paste it boom right click save as image and then you're gonna upload it right back to here where we were and follow where we right where we were and follow choose media and then you're gonna upload it where we had it boom simple as that and you know what this works same thing with sub and get the sub i'm gonna show you it but it works the same thing and how i have mine is i think you already seen it but this is my message thank you blah 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 for the follow welcome to rns and you can move this how you want it you can move this how you want it and it's gonna pop up when you do it and then also with the sound, you can also change the sound. So that's how you do the follows. All right, and right after that, we're gonna go to Sub Alert. Sub Alert works almost exactly the same. So like I say, you're gonna go to Media. You could rather do Giphy or Media Library, however you want. How I did it is Giphy once again, and I chose Donation, where my Donation one was. Boom, I have the same settings for the animation, and how it fades. You can alter this how you want it and how you like it. Same thing with the sound, and then same thing with this. And this is how my shit looks, and it'll pop up right above me when I do it. And if you wanna see that, boom. It's gonna pop up right above me. And it says, thank you whoever just sub and just like that, we're gonna go into Gift to Sub. Like I said, it works the same exact way. So you're gonna go to either Giphy or Media Library. You're gonna choose your media, whatever you'd like. You're gonna go to Animations, how you ever you want it to fade, how you want it to look, how you want it to leave. Then you can go to Sound, do the same thing. Boom, right? User, you can have the message however you want it. This is what mine looks like. Me so, oh my, my God, that's loud. Money! Give me my fucking money! Boom, and that's how you do all of the sub alerts follow alerts and chat all right and right after that we're gonna be going into chat filters we're gonna have to get this blurred out but these are the chat filters i have because i don't want people coming in my chat and saying stuff like this so all you have to do is go to add a banned word whatever you want it to be banned and if they type that word instantly it's gonna be deleted it can be whatever you want boom and just like that will be deleted a loyalty point so this is how you set up loyalty points which is kind of like cat rewards and all of that in chat so mine is going to be called rns points points will drop five a minute points will drop every five minutes and ten per and you know what i'm saying when you're inactive for what let's say like i like lurkers so, so say where you're inactive for 15 minutes boom you won't get no more points but i might change that i might change that to not because you're lurking so who you know what i'm saying that's how that works right this is the leaderboards nobody has earned it yet because i've been streamed since i've done this and then with these loyalty points you can bring that right into tts and you can turn this on and they can use those points and they can make text-to-speech which is pretty cool that's how that works into commands so i uploaded every command i had from my twitch chat into my kick chat and some of these don't work so this right here it, it would be a picture of little dirt but if you have more than 10 special characters it won't work i don't know why that's a thing but it doesn't work but that's how you add a command so you're gonna go to add to command whatever the command you want i could do chicken right put that samson loves chicken 
You can make it, it cost points, you may have a cooldown, all that, right? And then I'm gonna go to my kick channel, type in chicken, and just like that, oh, it might take a little bit. And Samson loves chicken, boom, that was pretty simple. All right, so this is how polls work. So you can create a poll, whatever you want the poll title to be, and then you can make the duration of it however you want any of this to be. I personally do not like how this poll thing works, and I will not be using it, but say I do a poll on what should Samson play. Actually, no. Cut this out. We're not doing poll. All right, boom. So now this is how Discord alerts get sent out. I'm gonna delete this and I'm gonna go through with y'all on how to do it. All you gotta do is add alert, right? We're gonna do live on. We're gonna do live on Discord. And then we're gonna put my Discord URL. So for me, it would be boom. It would be in this channel from livebot.app. And you're gonna do validate. And so when I go live, instantly it will be said that I'm live here. Next, we will be going into how to add your chat into your OBS. So it's pretty easy. You're just gonna go to docs, right? And you see, I already have it up and all you have to do is type and it'll be there, right? To do it, you're gonna go to custom docs. And then you're gonna go to just name it kick chat, pretty easy. Right, you're gonna go to stream, you're gonna copy this out, you're gonna pop this out, you're gonna copy and paste this right here. Once you copy and paste that, you're gonna add that right here where we did kick chat. Just name it kick, boom. <laughs> copy and paste that, and boom, just like that, we have a kick chat, and we can just drag it over here, and it'll be added to our OBS. After that, a lot of people don't know how to get subs or how you get subs, this, that, and third. To unlock subs, it's pretty easy. All you have to do is reach 75 followers and stream for five hours. That's all you have to do, and then you'll automatically unlock a sub button. After that, you'll have to set up everything with a, a, a website on how to get payments and all that, and just like that, you have your sub button. Moderators, to add a moderator, they have to be following you, pretty simple. Badges, we got VIP badges, OG badges, which is kinda like founders, and we got sub badges. I only have these three sub badges right now, but all you have to do is upload a file via 36 by 36 and your sub badge is added. Show you guys as an example, just like that, I've added a six month badge, which is a white badge. It's pretty easy. I already touched on emotes. And with that being said, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like, go ahead and subscribe. As you can see, I'm on kick. I'm streaming literally as soon as I upload this video. So, hey, if you're not tuned in, go ahead and follow me on kick i love this platform their community support managers are absolutely amazing their staff is amazing their social media website is amazing they get right back to you i dm them and they instantly responded to me which is amazing where where are you gonna see that from on another streaming platform so hey man if you haven't already made a kick channel go ahead and make one go ahead and make those because kick is going to take off mark my word kick is going to take off and this will be, if not the best streaming platform to come out, it will be one of these. With that being said, said you love me, you be forever riding with me. But you switch up somewhere and then you let your mind forgive me. Gotta say best, it's all my bro.